Hey y'all, let's look around Candytopia. Hey y'all, so today we're going to be touring this land named Candytopia. It's very nostalgic for me. Um, this land is very reminiscent of the board game Candyland. So let's take a look around. Um, first things first, this is an interactive game. So if you are in Second Life, you will get the HUD. It's easy to play with one person, but it is more so, in my opinion, is meant for more than one person. So feel free to bring your friends here and just have a blast. So first things first, we're going to go through these very, very yummy 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 rainbow candy canes everything looks so sweet and delectable look at all these ice cream cones with strawberry and mint chocolate chip all of those goodies i don't know what's going on with these ice cream cones but they don't have nothing to do with me these sweet fluffy and chewy looking macarons look so so delicious this super sweet ice cream looks delectable as well i love these huge pillowy fluffy trees they are so so they look so so yummy like the fluffiest um, candy cane that you'll ever get your hands on i want to go ahead and do an outfit check really quickly because i'm gonna have to take some of this stuff off so that i'll be able to sit and not be looking crazy so this is my outfit for today in hindsight the outfit that i wore to do the um other tour where we went and saw cinderella i think it was like the last video or the video before last that would have been more fitting for um this place but because i had already wore that outfit i just uh, decided to go with colorful um this is a dress that i believe it is versace inspired um i'm at that's just like an educated guess for the looks of it um i believe i got this on sale it was like 60 lenders or something like that. That's neither here nor there. So this is the outfit. I got this lollipop from here. And we'll probably, 9 out of 10, we'll pass it again. So if you guys are in Second Life, um, don't forget to grab your candy cane, um, your lollipops. And well, they have candy canes as well. So what I do want to do is I want to go ahead and just take this stuff off so we can be able to sit on stuff and don't look weird when we get up. So let me go ahead and take this off. This is going to be another As I See It in Second Life um, video. So, of course, my cursor will be making a debut every now and then. Don't try to lick the candy, the uh, lollipop now because you weren't trying to eat it at first. So you sit. And, of course, like I told you guys before, everything pretty much has a menu in Second Life. So feel free to enjoy the menu. So lots of places to take pictures and things like that i think this is a really cute place if you have like children in second life you want to take your kids around to look at um different things and take pictures and stuff like that i think this is a very fun place for that so we'll just go over here i walked around it before and it seems like every time i walk around i see something that's new these super duper soft shortbread cookie steps look so delicious i love 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 me an ice cream sandwich nice cold chili ice cream sandwich with these cool minty peppermint um for the gazebo i love 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 these peppermint trees this land is like i'm so confused i'm like i don't know if this is supposed to be like sugary sweetness on the ground or is it supposed to be snow i don't know maybe it's a combination i love these peppermint trees they look so so yummy and adorable so let's go into these houses and see what's going on these super sweet lollipops this one looks like it's going to be a little tangy tart like a lemon lollipop i love me lemons all day long i love a good lemon this looks like a chocolate chip room nice and fun it's so um nice looking up in here and very very um cool how they have like the chocolate chips and everything let's try to get it like a quicker a closer look at everything they made everything up so nice on this land it's not too complicated which i can always um appreciate but it's very well ooh, ooh, wrong thing my bad y'all it's very well decorated so as we can see we got this if y'all saw my setup in real life how i have this microphone you guys would be like what in the world girl i don't know i don't know you know i'm trying to get her done and she's getting done so we have that with the cute little chocolate chip um they have little cookies these are little chocolate well i guess these are donuts um heart-shaped chocolate donuts and but they have these super cute chocolate chip seats let's see if they have the animations in it yep animations in it yep they have three cool animations so we'll take a look at those really quickly 
I think it's a really cute role play land um, as well as a place for a good date as well. If it's like a first date or something like that, you guys can really have some fun on this land. So let's go ahead and see what they have in the second house. They have a couple houses lined up. Um, when I walked through here, I was just so overwhelmed with all of the beautiful colors. Everything looks so bright and colorful and fun. So I really, really did like that. It brought my spirits up for sure. Um, this is a cute little donut room. Just very simple. Um, everything, like I said, it will have something that you could probably like sit on. So I definitely would make, recommend like dressing up and coming and bringing your friends here. And you guys take some pictures and enjoy this beautiful interactive board game that they have here I just think it's so creative how they have everything set up this is a cute little Valentine's room with the little be mine and the little hearts those candy hearts that only look cute because they are nasty and they are hella hard if you know you know in real life so I'm just saying this looks like a cute very very um not a cute this looks like a very very sour lollipop like a lime but might be a candy apple who knows this house is so yummy looking it has like the little strawberry windows it reminds me of those cookies that have the little strawberry filling in the middle very very yummy with the little icing icicles coming up off of the house i love it um these things are super duper cute look at the little ferris wheel the little horsey ferris wheel with the peppermints and the gingerbread horses i love it so the lands always just bring me so much joy and happiness to walk around them and I love being able to explore them with you all. So now I think we have like a yummy yummy ice cream truck and who doesn't love ice cream? I mean come on, come on, Mr. Octopus loves ice cream, that's for sure. So you have this super duper sweet ice cream on this crunchy flaky waffle cone that I love. Three scoops please. I know that's right. With the yummy ice cream truck with the waffles on them. Let's see what type of ice cream. Let's, well, let's see what's on the inside. Let's let's get a little nosy. Let's get a little nosy. Um, I don't think this is a drivable car um, in my opinion. I think this is uh, more for role play. You can just kind of like sit in it and that's it. But that's cool. I love the um, ice cream truck. It has like the little chocolate sprinkles on it. One dollar per scoop. I know that's right. That's a good price. Very, very cute and yummy looking. It reminds me of a strawberry donut with chocolate frosting and sprinkles. Mm -hmm. Talk about a cavity. So as we go along, we get to do a lot of, they have a lot of little interactive things that you can do along the path. This is a cute little ice skating thing and they have it, they would say, it says click for skates. We're not going to do skates, but I think it does have like a thing where you could just click it and you could just like skate a little bit. So let me see, sit here and I think it has you skate. Yeah. So it'll have you skate a little bit, have a little bit of fun. Um, skate with the Care Bear. I know that's right. Mm-hmm. Y'all didn't, y'all didn't know I got down like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's come on. We're not gonna keep too. We're gonna spend too much time on this over here. So they do have like a little store in here, like a little candy store and things like that. I'm not sure where it is. I walked around for a while and I just kind of came across it. Look at this super cute waffle bench, like a Sunday waffle cone bench. It looks so crunchy and sweet. Everything looks so delectable and just, uh oh, take that off my bad, you guys. Everything looks so um delectable and just super duper sweet with a cherry on top. Love it, love it, love it. There's like a super cute picture that you can take here as well. Everything has sprinkles on it. Everything's sweet and fun and just everything that you want it to be in Candytopia. Definitely check this out if you guys are in SL. And if you're not in SL and you're coming to SL, definitely check it out. These cute little sundaes and all of these yummy, yummy, sweet, sticky lollipops. So, so nice. Got a lot of little candies going on here. This is where you can get you a lollipop. You can click for a lolly and it'll give you a little lollipop. Lollipop come up like this. We're gonna discard this one because I already have one. And so you just go along. And so with the game, with the HUD, it lets you know like where, where you're gonna be moving to. 
like the different positions that you're going to be moving to and so i really do like that it makes it very very easy to play this game some games in second life even though they're interactive sometimes they'll be a little bit um difficult to play or a little bit challenging to play but this one is not this one was very very nice and very easy to play um just off the top it wasn't difficult i didn't have to read any directions or anything like that my favorite lights beautiful very very nice yummy yummy sticky sticky chewy licorice i love it i love black licorice i know i know i love licorice i'm the black jelly bean girl everybody's like who eats black jelly beans that would be me so then we have these super duper pillowy cupcakes that look so fluffy and soft and look so so good oh I love a good cupcake. I, I don't I don't I don't know about y'all, but I I love a good cupcake. Everything is so colorful and just so fun and just full of life. I loved walking around here. They have this super cute um cupcake ride that you can just get on and then we don't have to necessarily do any positions or anything like that. And then you just go and click start and then you take you a little ride on your cupcakes. This reminds me, oh, and it has little music. This kind of reminds me of like those rides like at Disney World and stuff like that or like different amusement parks where you sit in and it has like the little wheel in the middle and you can kind of make it go as fast or as slow as you want it to. I thought that was cute, uh, super cute. I love how it looks like everything, all the cupcakes are on a plate and it's like a serving tray that you guys are going around on. I thought that was super cute. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I really liked it. I don't know how to stop this, so I'm just going to stand up. It might be a way to stop it. I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe it stops after a while. I don't know. Oh, I keep bringing this up. My apologies. Hold up. Did it be just my luck? YouTube is like, no. You can't have that type of music. So we're going to follow the pad because I don't want to miss anything. So everything, they have all little treats along the way. So as I click for cupcakes, you click it and get your cupcake and thing like things like that. So I really like that they have like little treats along the way and little things that you can interact with along the way while you're also playing the game. I thought that that was really, really cute and a great idea to keep everybody kind of involved. This is the little bridge that we didn't go over. We passed it at first, but that's just, you know, just coming over to this other side. So I do like how they let you have like little treats and stuff. So we've come across a lollipop, a candy cane, and cupcakes and things like that. So you have a lot of a little snacks and then they all have animations with them when you add them to your, um, to your avatar. So I thought that that was really cute. So we'll go a little bit off track and we'll go under this yummy, yummy, sticky, gooey gumdrop arch i love a good gumdrop i used to um eat gumdrops and then i would when i was a kid and sometimes i put them in my pocket and they would get like really really gooey and sticky and that wasn't the best but i still ate them because <laughs> i love me some candy so then we'll go this way and now we're in like chocolateville very very chocolatey i love chocolate um more of a sweetie candy type girl but i do enjoy chocolate as well i don't know what that is that looks weird i don't know so they have a lot of little cute little things over here this is like a little area that you could just sit in and just hang out and chill again take some pictures they have some super sweet little donuts that you can sit on let me get my cursor out the way get you a little drink and sit down enjoy your little donut take a little rest this is another little ride that's very similar to the cupcake ride that we were just on so we'll see how that goes yay and then you click it and you do yay i guess it's gonna start okay oh my god i guess i had to pick a different part of it and so you just go around and then the cups that you're in look like hot chocolate, which I really thought was super duper cute. I didn't realize it until I had panned up to look um, over and I was like, is that hot chocolate with the marshmallows? Come on, I know, I love it, love it, love it. So it looks super duper good, super duper sweet. Everything here just really gave me cavity vibes, but I loved every single moment of it, every single moment of it. Um, the best part of being able to be around all this candy is that you don't have to worry about getting cavities or anything like that. 
So we got little gingerbread cafe where you can get you some little snackies. This interactive. Yeah, of course it is. So you probably could click it and get you some hot chocolate and things like that. So we'll stay on the path because we do have quite, there is quite a bit here. I think we're going to go through the whole land because why not? Um, It wasn't too bad. The walk wasn't too bad. Um, There were just, a, it, was, it was a lot, you guys. It was a lot. They got little things that you can like go up and um sit on. Like you can sit up there just almost like a little observatory. You guys see how cute this land is like look at the sun i love it everything here is so playful it is really it's, it's so much nostalgia i love this gingerbread um choo-choo train those are the little strawberry filled cookies that i was talking about but they have them in the shape of a star and then the little gingerbread man everything is just so beautiful and picturesque i really really was excited to show you guys this place when i actually um came across it are we going the wrong way oh are we going the wrong way i think we're going the wrong way Hold up. So we came through here because I'm really trying to find a store. That's really what I want to go to. I really want to go to the store. I think we made a left and we're going to make a right when we get up here this time. So we're going back through the little gumdrop with the candy stripes. Um, these look like those little sour, sugary, sweet candy stripes that are on the ground. I love all of these. Look how cute all of these are. I love the sounds that they have over here the little unicorns and things like that as soon as i saw this land i said dang i said the outfit that i had on yesterday was well i don't know if it was yesterday but why does this keep happening what am i pressing oh the space bar okay um the outfit that i had on yesterday was way more fit. like i said i don't know if it was yesterday it was you know it was the fairy tale when i went to the fairy tale land this is like a little candy bubble i love this like a piece of bubble gum that's super cute i really like that um that outfit was so much more fitting i said listen oh i keep pressing the space bar you guys it's irritating me but it's okay um i kept telling myself i'm like that outfit would have been so much better um i'm trying to you know like i told you guys i'm trying to like wear outfits that go with the with the land that we're on so this is my favorite type of licorice right here mm -hmm, mm -hmm. i love me some black licorice i love it i it's it's something about the flavor a lot of people hate it most people do not like it i really like it i love this sugary sweet treat train with the cupcakes and you got the swiss rolls and you got the waffles with the ice cream look how detailed this stuff is you guys what i tell you the people in second life are so super creative and just so artistic look at the caramel sauce Ugh, look at the strawberries what if you weren't hungry you're gonna be hungry now you're gonna want something sweet at least look at this well how it looks like the chocolate is like plopping like the chocolate plop down into the chocolate milk it looks like or milk or something or caramel i don't know all these are like swiss rolls and peppermint trains with the candy rings and all of that and then the rainbow cannon that's shooting out all of that sugary sweetness all different types of cherries and macarons and cakes and cookies and pies just all kind of lollipops just sweet treats these look like skittles on the ground this is the candy store that i was telling you guys about so it's super duper yummy looking up in here so let's, let's take a look around I just felt like this land was so fun and the way that they did it i just kind of felt like it couldn't have been done better they always but like i told you guys they always do great when they do these lands they always do the lands are always very nice how cute is this a donut bouquet what who don't want that candy canes uh not candy canes cotton candy little donuts big huge cupcakes with the candles because happy birthday if it's anybody's birthday so they have this look at all that cotton candy galore you guys i know this is gonna be going on through the whole thing when i tell you guys it's actually 12 42 a.m right now when i'm doing this i should have been done this but a lot of stuff's been going on um this week and so i've kind of been preoccupied but you know we're gonna make it do what it do as usual so then we have this 
trying to like watch what I'm doing so I don't keep pressing that one button. It's like this little candy station with like little peppermints and candy canes and all this stuff. And it's a, I like the fact that I have like a lot of the things that they gave us along the way when we were um, walking the path. And so then we have this beautiful macarons. I love, I love these. I love these. I, I've had like every flavor that they probably could have. Um, one of my favorites is pistachio, believe it or not. I don't really like the chocolate macaron and I, I love chocolate, um, but I don't really like the chocolate macarons, you know, it's not my, not my favorite. I don't know. It's a little too moussey for me and it's kind of like a turn off to me in the macaron. I like the chewiness of the macaron. I don't really like the that fluffiness of the um like the chocolate mousse. It kind of throws it off for me. And then sometimes they make it where it's like fudgy and then it's just too sweet, too chocolatey, and then I don't like the fudgy. So I kind of stay away from the chocolate um macarons. So all of this yumminess that's up in this candy store, free for the picking nice little milkshakes they have these going on this reminds me of like when you go in the mall and they have like candy stores in the mall they'll have like things that look like this i thought this was super cute it almost they almost look like pills just keeping it a, a billion they almost look like uh, pills oh i didn't see them steps up there we're gonna go up them steps in a minute so it's like if you're the birthday girl or the birthday boy um you can go ahead and sit here and get you a little pick a little pick pick going on at candytopia I know that's right. Talking about striking a pose. She said, and am. It's so glittery over here. I really, really like that. I'll just be like, where they get all of this stuff? It has to be stuff that they make ahead of time. And just like that is not really sold in stores. Because it's like, I've never seen any of these things in stores are being advertised. Not saying that they weren't in stores or advertised. But I just never saw it. Because I just really feel like I would have got some of this stuff. I feel like I would have wanted a cupcake chair I do I, I feel like that's something that I would have purchased but I don't remember seeing it I'm really doing everything that I don't want to be doing right now so let's see look at this cake I know that's right stuffing her face with cake because that's the type of yumminess that's going on right now it's like how could you not look at this yummy sweet strawberry i love i love strawberries even though most of the times when i have them they're not even sweet but you know i digress so i do these videos over and over and over again sometimes because i sometimes feel like um look at these yummy gumdrops i do these videos over like i said over and over because sometimes i feel like oh it's nothing back here i feel like i'll be sounding mean and so i don't want to sound mean and so i'll redo the video and then i'll get a comment that's like oh your voice is so relaxing and i'm like oh i thought i sounded mean but i don't sound mean okay that's awesome so i'm just gonna stop being so critical of myself oh this is cute they have a lot of little stuff up here and just do the videos you know what i'm saying i really enjoy bringing this content to you guys because i really enjoy um exploring in second life come on go through the wall here we go this is super cute in here this would be so good for kids like a lot of people have kids in second life and i think this would be super duper cute if you have um kids in second life let's see if you can sit down of course you can sit down unless we're gonna do some bouncing so you could bring your kids yep i pressed it again you guys it's okay i don't have anything to hide in my in my chat lots of um what do i have lots of tps to go to places so you know me come out of here and go around here look how fun this looks mm -hmm. so you can jump around a little bit get your get your jump on get a little cardio going on i really like this this is going to be super cute for kids to jump around in you could take some really fun pictures with your kitties on here super cute okay i have this dress on have some damn decorum shy Okay, I don't even know which way we came in. So I'm gonna say we came in that way and then we're gonna go this way. Now this stuff I didn't see. I'll keep it a thousand. I didn't even see any of this stuff. When I came in here, I didn't see those stairs or anything like that. Oh, let me move my cursor over. I didn't see those stairs or anything like that. Look how cute this is. Oh, so yummy and fun. 
these donuts look so soft and chewy and fluffy and they have this beautiful icing on it that looks so so sugary sweet can i go through here i just walked through it i don't know what's on the other omg i love it i love it i'm definitely gonna have a seat i'm definitely gonna i don't know how long this video is gonna be but i love it uh, we're not gonna do any of those we'll just go with whatever animation is already in there oh you guys look at this with the tea coming out it's giving alice in wonderland reimagined um the colors are not like exactly like alice in wonderland colors but they're very very reminiscent yummy cakes lots of teacups and things like that this um was a dead giveaway for me this bookcase is like squiggly bookcase that's what really gave me like the alice in wonderland vibes so let's see let me get the cursor out the way so we can see what's this, this is like a, a interactive gingerbread house with what's on the gingerbread house we have some sweet chocolatey ice cream a nice little sweet sticky chocolate fountain with some chewy brownies on it we also have those sweet lollipops that are gonna get sticky after a while this beautiful fluffy 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 whipped cream topping with the cherry on top that everybody loves those very minty peppermints some chewy gingerbread man and some little sour straw or sour strips that's what it looks like i love it i love it i love it these are like some of my favorite um little cakes these little cakes right here i love it everything is so freaking cute yeah definitely giving alice in wonderland vibes definitely giving alice in wonderland vibes super cute look at that sandwich it looks it's giving pastrami i don't know i don't really eat that but doesn't mean it's bad okay i love it oh i'll be in here forever so we probably should just i want to look at something else though let me see i want to make sure that i saw everything that i needed to see before i get up it's another little clock yeah it's definitely alice in wonderland vibes and i really appreciate them for that I think it's going to be a lot of people that are going to miss this. Look at the chandelier with the Oreo cookies. I love it. The chandelier will get eight up. It wouldn't last. It wouldn't last. With the little fruit slices, the little gummy, sugary, sweet fruit slices that have your fingers all sugary. So you can eat the fruit slices and then you can lick the sugar off your fingers so you get like two treats in one. So go back through. I like how they have it like a little secret room. Because when you turn around, it's like that. You can't really see what's in there. It's like you could look at the picture, but you don't really. It doesn't look like it's something that you'll be able to go through. But you actually can go through it. That's what I like about it the most. And so it does give you, let you know, like, yeah, it's kind of Alice in Wonderland vibes. And then when you go in, it's so cute. It's like a little hidden room. I love it. So we have that and then we went in there already i think this thing had a option for you to go down let me see let's go back over there and see if we could just like take a down here we go i thought that's what i saw is it gonna take me down candy castle here we go okay and now we're back at the beginning so then we can come on out those beautiful beautiful pillowy donuts stacked on top of each other just waiting to be smashed down and just ate so so yummy everything was just so decadent here i was so excited when i walked through here i was like i gotta show you guys this place this is a wonderful place to like i said to bring any friends or anybody you can come by yourself just to look around I know that's right. They have a lot of cute um sounds around here. Um, this is a really nice place, like I said, to come either by yourself or with friends. It's a great place for pictures, like really cute, fun pictures to take um with your friends or again by yourself. So this is Candy Topia, you guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And as always, I'll see you guys next time.